Hoping for live. Just open my Twitch so I can actually see if I'm live. And see how many people are watching. Yep, I'm live. Watching now. Right, I had a request. Oh, my mute, 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 mute. Okay, thank you. I forgot to mute myself. Right, I had a request for a penny comic. So it's not really my choice what's going to be drawn today. Mm -mm -mm. So first let's get the text right. Seven ninety one, almost eight hundred comics. It's great that a certain person has posted online that he's very proud of creating eight hundred comics. Yeah, so did I. And I didn't get paid for it. Yeah, I'm a bit jealous. I'm a. I know I'm jealous. It's okay to be jealous. That person worked hard for it as well. Right, VTuber. Um, sorry. I just uh, work with VTubers off screen, so I forgot to put the VTuber on. On its way, on its way. Um, and I guess it's not June anymore, so no more cocoa. So that means penny time. Which is a lot closer. Uh, where is my stream? And now to make it small. Uh, I'm, I'm, do I'm, no, I'm doing uh, stupid. Sh shouldn't do stupid. There we go. And close. There we go. It's penny time! Now back to the article. Grammar, grammar. Um, let's see. This is the first time I'm actually making a comic with licensed characters that are not stuck in the back. Oh. And lately I'm getting a lot of spam through my uh through my Telegram. So random people, always ladies' names, like, hi, how are you, can I talk to you? And I'm like, A, I don't know you, B, why you're talking in English, C, who the heck are you? So, delete. Uh, 
I'm also a bit hyperactive today. I've been for past few days. So I'm even more chaotic than usual. I have no idea what the reason is. Uh, but I'm just very hyperactive. Chaotic, going left and right. So um, my intention is after this stream I will continue the visual novel. But I, A, I don't know how much I can do of it and B, how long. And my chaotic nature seems to be presenting themselves and making lists. Really, what the heck is wrong with me? Um, right. Ugh. I really hate it when it doesn't get the brush setting right. That's what you get with old software. Uh, year 16. Well, it could be the weather, because the weather is being crazy the past few days. And you know what they say? If it's storming, then the kids are crazy uh, storming as well. So it is possible that it's the weather. But um, usually I only get this hyperactive if I had a lot of sugar. Like I drank uh, Coca-Cola or I had some Turkish Delight. You know, the really sugary things. And then I suddenly start being very hyper hyperactive, jumpy, and uh, to be honest, I did have way too much chocolate today. I mean, that's the reason why I'm late in the stream, because I had to visit the little girl's room a few times. But the sugar should have worn off by now. I ate that about two hours ago. So yeah, my uh, random thoughts are even more random than usual. More chaotic than usual. Um, I'm still editing book 5. Doesn't go as fast as, as I want it to. But we'll be getting there. I still have time and otherwise it will just be a little bit late. It would suck, but hey. Uh, I'm not going to uh, work myself into depression. And let's make that chibi. Mm. Um, let's look Peppa Pig. Because I have no idea how Peppa actually looks. Or how to draw. So that's like going the top. It's beady eyes next to each other. Like I said, th this is the first time I'm using legit characters. And round ears. A kind of uh, twig feet. Okay. And now to get something transformer. Oh, uh, 
Transformers. I did really like Transformers as a kid, by the way. Uh, let's just go for Optimus. I really like Beast Wars. So there's a Beast Wars movie coming, and I actually want to see that. But I'll always get the DVD. Doesn't have to be perfect. People have to be able to recognize the characters. And always small faces. Those designs of the Transformers are actually very well thought through. Which of course makes sense. And um, this is my excuse to draw Derpy again. But Derpy is not allowed to be named by name. Always look for reference. Derpy is my favorite character of uh, Gen 4, I believe it's. I even had her uh, included in my wedding register binder. I usually don't get requests of uh, the editor of the newspaper. So I only had a f actually about 30 minutes to think about it. Otherwise I would have to uh, cancel the comic I would have drawn. And this is my excuse to draw Misty Brightwater. Because she is my favorite pony of the next gen. Oh, sorry, Misty Bright Dawn. Um, and I actually like her original better than the new one. Um... Because the new one is just buy our toys revelations for those who get the reference. That looks scary. Let's first get this right. Mm. 
course, I have no idea about the new style how to get all the things, expressions, faces. And this is actually, she has a more rounded face. How about I take this image as a reference? Now we have this, this. <laughs> My favorite princess is Luna as well. We are a Luna household. This needs to be oh, higher. And from the main six, I like Fluttershy best, but Derpy forever. I'm not very fond of Opaline, of the new series. She's just more like a very standard villain. But I know target audience and the likes. I was looking forward to uh, Bride of Woodstock, but unfortunately that was very disappointing uh, to me. Actually, saw so, uh, say I draw transformers now and lock the layer. Well, lock the layer, higher transparency, and line art. Okay, something dropped. It didn't cry, it didn't crash, it's fine. <laughs> you don't have to be old to know these ponies. Because these ponies are like... Well, four or five years old? Not when they originated, that was about ten years ago or something like that. From the original, original series, so like the very, very first one, I really liked... Uh, let's see, my, my favorite pony was Posey. 
I really didn't like what they did to her in the new series, but hey. <sighs> At least she's in it. But I really like Posey. And I believe I also had an Applejack. Um... So it was really fun uh, to see it rebooted. And it was fun to sometimes see characters. I like Gusty. I really like Gusty as well. Hence why I was very pleased when they had the Grogar uh, part in um, the last season. I was like, wow, Grogar, Grogar. And my love, who also watches ponies, well, didn't really watch that se season. He was like, Grogar? Who's Grogar? And I was like, Grogar! Who doesn't know Grogar? But yeah, like stated, been a My Little Pony fan since about 1983, probably 1985. When did My Little Pony start? I believe before the 80s. And I still have my most precious ponies. Um. <laughs> Nineteen eighty three. So I wasn't lying. At least nineteen eighties. But yeah. And people accept it that I'm quirky and fan of these toys and all the likes. And if they don't accept it and call me childish, then well, that's their problem. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I put my drink in front of my miniature screen. Also, let's hydrate. I also uh, received the new uh, microphone I ordered. Haven't been able to look at it yet. Maybe tomorrow evening, maybe first day. I don't know just yet. I'm just gonna test if it works. And if it does, I'll just do something decent with it later on. And I, uh, it, this is, uh, well, more or less a competition. Who gets to host the next Hasbro games? I didn't even know they had Hasbro games, but okay. And uh, I sincerely doubt it will be hosted in my town. But if it does, I can say I did everything I could. As long as it includes ponies, I'm cool with it. <laughs> A penny doll. I wished. I would have to make uh, national uh, comics instead of local ones. But hey, the fun is nice. Ooh, my little pony penny uh, version. Uh, 
And I think Penny's uh, base coat. Well, at least she has uh, orange manes. And blue eyes. And then either the body will be blue or purple. And I'm leaning towards blue, to be honest. But... Or maybe a uh, top blue with pink legs. Eh. The fans may uh, create something about that for now. Maybe I can uh, find a... Pony creator online. But that's, that's not important right now. Smiley Chan is a cutie mark, that would be nice indeed. And I think Penny would be an Earth Pony. Is my free tuber stuck? Oh no, there they go. There she goes, there she goes. Where is my Transformer Optimus Prime? Mm -hmm. <sighs> he has this weird grid over here. I know people with cars are like, it's that and it's that. And I'm like, I just don't know what I'm drawing. <laughs> I do like the face of Optimus Prime that I drew. But yeah, it's really those super uh, hero models. White chest. Autobots rollouts. But yeah, I really like Beast Wars. I was a big fan of Waspinator. wheels and something weird over here save it
It's my cute, chunky Optimus Prime. I, I could probably do better, but uh, then I would need a lot more time. And the goal is to create a Penny comic in about an hour. And uh, I don't wish to sell fan art. But this time it's fan art that's needed for the comic. So I kind of think I can get away with that. That's a bit too big, but I like the hand. Okay, my hyperactivity is wearing off. But I still have trouble focusing. I also noticed I now have 100 followers on YouTube. I still have no ID. By the way, by the time you uh, see this video, it might be more. Because I upload this videos about... Well, about half a year in the future. Just so people who watch it on uh, Twitch get the exclusive, so you can watch it for a week on Twitch. And then you have to wait half an a year to visit or see it on uh, YouTube. That's a bit too long, I think. Oh. Don't yell outside. You got people are way too noisy outside anyway. Thumb is way too small. Is it raining? Cool. I always like the sound of rain. Yep, definitely raining. Well, I wish I could hear the sound of falling rain, but I also hear a lot of people screaming outside. <sighs> huh. 
How long have I, am I streaming now? I'm currently streaming 45 minutes. Hmm. It goes quite fast, actually. I thought I was at least at 45 minutes by now. Thumbs are on the inside. And who knows, maybe by the end of the year. Ah, this pan is terrible. Uh -huh. Need some extra guidelines. Maybe by the end of the year, when this video is up, it's already uh, hosted. And these hands are way too small, but really, are those, those th yeah, thumbs are on the inside, so just need to make them a bit bigger, but that's okay, this is something I can do, as long as I have some guidelines. But I don't think you see that bump that much, wait. I'm probably just gonna hide the other hand with more hair. What I really like about Misty is, uh, first of all, her name. I'm really a sucker for the name Misty. And uh, I like that she has cornrows in her hair. And uh, if you don't know what cornrows are, those are those uh, bead, uh, braids that are really tied to the head. They have eyebrows now. The cats are making noises again, which they shouldn't be making. Um, how about I make the ear low? And then they have, she has like... I'm keeping Misty hostage. Hm. Can't really get uh, the hair to cover up much, but at least part of it. Mm -hmm. So this goes about here. Hmm. <sighs> 
I'm a spoiled little thing. I want more ponies. Nothing about friendship, just give me ponies. I actually draw way too little ponies, but... Huh, I would draw way too little ponies. <laughs> but, uh... Just like mermaids, I draw way too little mermaids. Really? Little mermaids. And part of the back still. Okay, I think this is all the line art. It's going to be lots of hand coloring details. So don't worry about miss spots. I'll probably see them and do them later on. Lock it so I can't mistake the layers. I could, of course, just copy this. Copy image. And then just copy. And I have at least the right skin tone. And hair. Mm -hmm. And other hair. Because I should do at least a decent uh, work of Misty. Uh, so yes, Misty. The name is Misty. Uh, wrong screen. And Transformers. Optimus Prime. And there might be people going like, ooh, that's the wrong type of blue, wrong type of red, and I'm like, meh. Lots of hand coloring over here. Mm -hmm. And some gray. I mean, I don't want any copyright infringement or something like that, that I'm being too popular, which I doubt, by the way, so... Because technically I'm using their characters and they could send a cease and desist, though uh, this is this might actually fall under the far, fair use, which means um, it's done... In a satire way, I don't consider this satire by the way, but it's not with the intention to make money out of it. Okay, now Peppa. Uh, I don't like Peppa. But hey, I'm not the target audience. I'm also not the target audience for. Uh, the what's it called again for my little pony <laughs> and 
and black feet. And everything else is going to be hand colored. Okay. And now we go coloring the characters. Interesting. Is this on multiply? Is it on darken? See, I need multiply. That's when the lines get n nicer and coloring gets nicer. But don't worry, your favorite characters will not be appearing regularly. Sometimes I hide a character. I mean, if you look carefully through the comics, you can find uh, Sailor Moon. You can find uh, Shampoo a few times, actually. Shampoo is a few times in there. Uh, Akane and Ranma. And you can actually find a Dalek. From Doctor Who. Yeah, the shampoo on the Alec, uh, Alec shirt doesn't uh, count for the cameos. There are actually shampoo cameos a few times. And most appeared in the early days of my relationship. Because I learned of shampoo after my relationship started. bit lighter actually because because you can say whatever you want I'm still pale and yes I notice Misty's horn is still uncolored that will be hand colored There's lots of things that need to be hand colored in this comic because everything is so tiny whiny. And of course, faces, mouths. Mm -hmm. First the mouse. Okay. 
<laughs> Peppa has pink hands as well, so let's get that. Mm, wait. Penny's eyes are always the same color as her shirt. So I can color those as well. Okay, first we save, then we hydrate. Mm-hmm. Trying to work with shortcuts on my keyboard. But of course, some shortcuts are not the same in Photoshop as they are in Clip Studio Paint. <laughs> and of course, sometimes I just forget to use shortcuts as a whole. And I know ponies don't have sharp teeth, but it's for humor. And she has pink ear. And this needs to be done with a soft brush. Mostly pink with the top. And next week, this will appear on Equestria Daily, and I'm like, okay. Which I doubt, by the way, that was a joke. First, we're gonna do the highlights. Oh. 
might actually com get complaints that I didn't include my enough Luna, but that's okay. I can't include every pony. And putting in Twilight Sparkle would be way too uh, predictable. And if I have to choose between Luna or Derpy, Derpy's on top. Uh, I do have uh, the Bishoyo Luna statue, not the bootleg. I actually paid full price for that. And I once got a figurine that is technically a color yourself cadence, only it has Luna's colors. I don't really have a lot of Luna merchandise, because there's very little decent Luna merchandise. Now the background. <laughs> Pony ki uh, kidnapped by me. Maybe Hasbro will come to uh, our town then. Free Misty. Oh, Mr. Spot. I will do that after I finish selecting this all. You always miss a spot. It's just easier to do like this. First of all, let's do this so I can see if I missed a spot. Oops. Then I can return to my color layer and color this little bit. Let, let's make it a pinkish background. Because we can. Of course, I need to vote myself, by the way. Shouldn't forget that. But first, the text balloons. First A, then B. See, all my hyperness is completely gone. I'm super tired. And I'm being very vague again. Oh, I forgot to do freckles on uh, Misty's face, so I will do that too. There we go. Misty needs her freckles. 
not really fond of the more gradient and colorful ponies of the new season, but yeah, that's why I said I don't really like her redesign, where she suddenly gets a uh, purple, orange, pink hair. It just doesn't look like Misty, but hey. I'm not a target audience, but if a figurine comes in my possession, I would treasure it forever. Hmm. Maybe this goes better. Okay. Everyone can go text check. Can I? There. Hasbro-spelen.nl Breng jouw stem uit. Nieuwe hij. Always nieuwe hij. Nou, is akkoord. Send the email. And while I'm waiting for the others, I can open up the penny file for the text. Uh, it's the 4th of July. Yeah. Happy Independence Day to whoever celebrates it. Would be September of October. Mm. 
And I'll post the link in the chat for whoever wants to vote. Okay, you guys can go text check. Ah, yes, the usual uh, spam that there was a Trojan installed and uh, they've, uh, they're locked into my account and now they can connect it to everything and ah, they recorded me. She's uh, looking at nasty adult content. You know, the things I don't do, and they recorded me in a webcam. Uh-huh, sure. Delete. Okay. Now to save my work because everybody text checked. Ah, memory full. I really don't like it when it does that, but okay, it happens. taking way too long so I probably won't be able to do much for my visual novel but hey every step is something uh, this one And good evening to you. I'm glad you still could join us. Night wouldn't have been the same without you. So, this one is done, and I will 
send it soon, but first I want to do at least something for my visual novel. Uh, no, wait, I completely at the wrong place. Mm -mm. Door close up. I had to spend my uh, coins again, so I got some random brushes because your points aren't really um, that long valuable available right um I'm going to make a new folder with floor and don't I have a floor one? Nah, that's that's not the good one. I think I had one with cobblestones. Here. Seamless cobblestones. Thumbnail has been made. I did not click here, so uh no we'll we'll do that later, but sure I, I kinda did this. Uh, first of all, new layer and a bit of a brownish stuff, ground, mm, it's more grayish. Then I need to enlarge my cobblestones. Yes, apply transformation. Uh, no, wait, I can transform, skew, was skewed, no, that was not skew, um, <laughs> perspective, free transform, Hmm. Okay, that's more closer to what I need, and now I need to make it bigger. And my sketch is going to be on top of the floor, otherwise I won't be able to see things. And we're going to have a cabinet. Do I have a cabinet? Closet. Mm, shelf. Nope, that is something I need to create by hand. Well, okie dokie. Cabinet. Mm, First, I'm going to make this brown. I do like lighter brown. Maybe a bit yellowish. Uh, layer. Lock this one for a bit darker. It doesn't have to be perfect because of course it's it's uh it's a little cottage in the forest with things hand may and all.
Hmm. No. Uh, where's my lock transparency? Lock transparency, lock transparency, and lock transparency because these are going to be hand shaded. <laughs> Um, wait, I can't use purple right now because then it would be weird. And I need a brush. That's a bit too dark. Now I can use the purple. That's a bit too much. And multiply. That's the first shading layer. That's a too big brush for now. Now we need some texture, uh, and we need to be clipped. Oh, that's the wrong one. I need my scans for my texture. And I recently scanned some wood texture, I just haven't been able to import it just yet, so yay! Now it's this. This is a wood texture, good. Yeah, I'm not making the same mistake today again. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to duplicate it. Now we're going to add some more texture. And because of this extra layer, it just looks more grainy. So that's the cabinet. And the floor. I've come, I'm going to do the floor shading at the end. Because there are 
other things going to be in, otherwise I have to keep on redoing the shade. So, let's see. Oh, this was hanging over. This was a table, a broken table. I think I can do that. I have no idea what broken stuff this is, but it's broken. I have broken stuff here. This is a cloth. This is a hand. Um, and I think I can still do the table. Or at least it's, it's a wooden pane. That's broken. So we're going to do it like this. Wooden table. I'm gonna make it a bit greenish. If possible. No, that's not working. Okay, remove the sketch for now. Let's tables over here just for now. So it's going to be easier to add textures. Mm -hmm. This was hand. This was an actual photo of grain. This tablet I no longer need. Where's my sketch? What's this? That's not a wood grain. Downside of scanning things high resolution is that it takes a while before it's open. <sighs> That's not. A, I had to not a wood grain texture thing. Maybe in grunge. I mean, it would fit to have at least something there. That's at least something of a texture already. But I also need something wood grainy. And I still have about a thousand images to categorize and I'm still scanning things. So new stuff comes regularly. actually like it even if it isn't really a texture for a table but I do like it there's some glitter in there which I'm not a fan of but hey it, it works for texture purposes To get more texture, 
that I want to be able to see it better. So maybe I need to reverse the layers. There we go. <sighs> but the table is now of a wrong color. It's too orange. It needs to be grungier. <laughs> and I actually wanted it somewhat greenish. And I am reading your message, I'm just not going to reply on it publicly because um, you never know who's listening, who might use this information. But I'm glad you're ready to go. perhaps and then uh, it goes very yellowish again oh that's way too green I think I need to keep it to multiply and I shouldn't forget that the house is dark because there's no light Okay, so first I'm going to duplicate the layer, merge it, yeah. merge it into one image, mm -mm -mm. merge select the layers, there we go, and now we can wait until it's loaded. Move the table over here, make it a bit bigger, there we go, and then we have to skew it again. There it is. And it's like a bit this way. And I need to get a clipping layer, hard brush, and then I need a few purple lines. Clip it. I keep on mistaking the clip. It. There we go. Uh, duplicate it. Blur. Gaussian blur. Gaussian or whatever it's called. And some global shading. There is still light coming through a broken window. Let's 
And remember all the correction, tonal uh, correction comes at the end. And I need, because it's nice that I made holes and things broken, but physics would dictate that they're still wood visible. And if I would do an overall shade, I already have an overall shade. But that would be inside. This is the first overall shade. I'm doing it with uh, purple, uh, the uh, black. I should do it with purple. And then I'm first going to do the big shade. This, oh, this is one of those things uh, where it won't properly do what it has to do. And I have no idea what's causing that. First, we're going to save it. I'm going to delete this layer. Okay, let's first see if this works. And then multiply. See, the, it doesn't want to uh, shade using purple anymore. This sometimes happens, and I have no idea why. Does other layer properties work? Nope. Just layer properties don't work anymore, all of a sudden. For some odd reason. Okay. Uh, There's no such thing as too much purple. Hmm. Well, I guess then we'll just shade with black, I guess. Not much fan of it, but... Oh, wait, that's the wrong layer. This should be normal. Oh, great, I'm mixing up things. Um, you should stay, yes. Then I need to go this way. This needs to go normal, and this needs to go overall purple. I think it has to do something with uh, the amount of memory something has. But it just doesn't want to do that anymore. Okay, and I'm going to do something about the ground because the ground is way too solid, perfect. Um.
that looks already better but it still needs some extra because here the layers work perfectly that's why there's something sometimes something just goes wrong and nobody knows why Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so at least the floor doesn't look that. <sighs> That's solid just yet. And overall shading, there's going to be trash everywhere. Well, everywhere. On certain spaces, there's going to be trash. So yeah, this is what I'm going to do. This. At least I did something. I mean, that's nice. So maybe next time I'll uh, well add some clutter. That hand. Yes, that hand. And then this frame should be done as well. Like I said, it's, the, it's something. I made improvement. And after this, what's, uh, you're going more inside. So I have to think about how to show the dead people without making it too gruesome. I don't even know how the people look. And then soon, soon we can get to the mirror scene and then I can create Naraku. As a character, you can actually see. So we're not there yet, but at least we're stick, uh, inching closer, step by step. So, um, this will be it for today. I'll be seeing you next time, whatever that's going to be. Thank you for joining me. Bye bye.